Good afternoon, everyone. Chillable Seven here, and today we're gonna play Pokemon Platinum Nuzlocke Plus. Um, last time we were challenging Barry, and we defeated the gym leader. However, we lost someone in the process. And also, the reason why I didn't want to exit the gym is because of time constraints last episode, and I'm pretty sure there's gonna be a certain set of dialogue. So, let's just see what's going on outside. The moment we step out from this door. Yep, there it is. With no control. Oh hey, you got the gym badge here, huh? What'd I tell you, Mr. Wake, I mean, the master is pretty awesome, hey? Um, and he's stepping out from the building. What's this racket then? Oh, it's you two. And there he goes, Barry, pretending that he has one, uh, master. <laughs> oh, master! Listen, kid, I know your father, I won't deny that. But I don't recall ever taking you as an apprentice, not in the least. Besides, you two don't need me. You can become strong on your own without being my apprentice. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I made you my master. I decided. But forget that. There's trouble brewing. There's a Team Galactic goon in front of the obs observatory gate. He said something about using a bomb. What? <clears throat> no one messes with Pistoria. Not on my watch. Okay, we're gonna see what's going on here. Hey, master, wait. Uh, but before we go any further, we gotta deposit Pokemon in the in the in the discard pile. No, not in the discard pile, in the death box. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna deposit Leafy in the... <sighs> it couldn't take an ice fang. <laughs> Why isn't Grass-type Pokemon getting any much love there? And I guess we could put Jolteon in the um, PC for the healing trick. And we still haven't got our final form yet. Okay. Okay. So, we haven't caught a Pokemon from one of the routes, so maybe I should do that right now. While we have time left. And the route in question is this one. And... And we have to go to catch Pokemon in this route. Oh, it's raining much heavily than before. Anyways, the first encounter we're gonna get in this route is... It is a Shellos. Oh, we already got her. Okay. What we can do is to run away. Unless we are too slow to run away and we're gonna be stuck there. But I'm pretty sure Primplup can outspeed a Shellos. Okay, anybody else who wants to show up in front of me? It is a Krogunk. Oh, not bad. We got a Poison type and a Finding type. Oh, we have. Do we have a Finding type? No, not yet. Unfortunately for you, Krogunk, you benefit much from the rain because of. Because of what's it called? Rain... Rain dish. No, dry skin ability. What about Peck? Can it take it out? Please don't take it out. We need you. Okay, good. Oh wait, I'm not... I'm not afraid yet. I mean, my Primplup's not a steel type yet, and you do have rain dish. I mean, not rain dish. Um, dry skin. Ah, I keep confusing the two. I mean, both abilities heal Krog... Um, Krogunk in the rain. I mean, both abilities enable healing, healing in the rain. Anyways, I'm gonna use a heal ball because I might need you in the team. And we got an empty, um, empty space for it. Oh! Okay. Oh, Swagger, huh? You're gonna double my attack. Now I have to, like, not injure you at all. If, if somehow I can try to change the weather, it'll be nice. Okay, we finally got it. Fortunately, that's a female Krogunk, so, um, I don't know. I don't know what to name you. <laughs> it's a female Krogunk. Uh, um, let's see. Oh, well, I'll name you Lily. There we go. Okay, we got a poison type in our team. Well, actually, we already got a poison type. We got a funny type in our team. It is... What nature is it? Lax nature, okay. Neutral. Doesn't harm its offensive um, stats. Anyways, we got a little bit of an item update to show that we don't have more than 6 items. Actually, the exception will be rare candy and um, those vitamins. Because we can have more than 5 because it doesn't involve using rare candy in battle. I mean, I mean, how can you use rare candy in battle? You just level up immediately? I guess that might work. You just like... Like get a little bit more health and then, and then 
some stat increases. Hmm. Okay. Oh wait, no, we're not gonna deposit in a dead box. I meant to put in uh, box one. And I guess I could use um uh, my unofficial HM sleep in a team, cause why not? If there's some obstacles that we need to overcome, then then be barrels are um choice here. And I think I'm going to keep defog and not double team. Okay, there's the there's the problem. Oh, there's Barry here. What are you doing here? What are you talking to me from there? Okay. Um. Okay, let's go. Hey, what am I? Chopped the liver? Don't forget I'm here too. So, where's the collect? Doom. Oh, it's an earthquake. Not too scary though. Actually, it kind of looks like an earthquake, but it's not. It's the blast radius. Boy, that was rough. You, what have you done? What have I done, you're asking? Well, technically speaking, it wasn't me. The package that arrived, see, that was a bomb, named the Galactic Bomb. Me, I was sort of pushed the button, so I did, like, poink? Oh, that's right, mustn't forgot. This test needs, this test results needs re reporting. Cheerio then, you daft culture, your mask absurd. Wow, that Team Galactic run showing no remorse. <laughs> you two, do not follow me, don't let anyone else in, either. It'll be big trouble if there's any of that bomb left. Alright, so... Actually, we cannot, um... I cannot go in the Safari Zone. Yeah. Go after the Galactic Gun. Okay. Super speed with a bike. Anyways, what about... what? What's with you? Stop chasing after me, you. I'm half a mind to pulverize you with my Pokemon, but I have to move my way to the lake ASAP, so you're lucky I'm out. Alright, do I make myself clear? Don't you dare follow me. I'll follow you until you quit, man. Don't... Don't... Ain't you don't tell me what to do. Oh, see? Oh, wow. He didn't get that far. We needed the energy from the Valley Windworks to make this. It would take a significant genius to make something like this. Therefore, our boss who made this is a scientific mechanical genius. Are you whispering? What are you whispering about? You were evade dropping. I was just thinking out loud. But I'm not going to waste my energy knocking you around. Keep running. I'll chase after you. It doesn't matter. Oh, of course. Why Pokemon will distract me? Weasel, I already caught you. Oh, we need, we need backups. Oh, I can't escape, what the heck. Oh, Aqua Jet, that does no damage. Okay, come on, please let me go. Okay, thank you. Yeah, I'm, wow, Primplup speed's far too low. <laughs> let me check, let me check Primplup speed here. You can't be too slow. See, 42 speed, that's, that's decent. And yet, Buizo still outspeeds me. What's Buizo's space speed? I don't know, have no clue. Anyways, you there. But boy, this collecting bomb packs a pretty big wallop. With this baby here, doesn't how much we can't blow up. I wonder what they have planned for this. Um, it's not something for you to worry about, you're just a grunt. You were already vase dropping, I was just thinking out loud. You're a persistent pest, I'm tired of running away, but I'm not gonna waste my energy knocking you around. Oh, okay, we're about to chase them too. <laughs> Hello, my friend. The cargo that the Team Galactic brought is worrisome, so I have come. You say the cargo has a bomb, and there was an explosion? The explosion was a great marsh? Furthermore, you're pursuing a man. A man with funny, bowl-cut hair. In an outfit that is very strange. In other words, that is the Team Galactic. Oh, how did I miss it? The man who I have seen running away, he was the bearer of the bomb. This will not do. Wait, wait, I say. Oh, it looks like he's gonna pursue the grunt too. Alrighty then. Fair enough. That's not mean that I don't have to do anything anymore. And there's the item here that I didn't pick up. Oh, wow. Um, this item would normally be useless, but you can exchange it for move tutors. It's pretty hard to get. Um, it's pretty hard to get the uh, um, a limited supply of shards if you want a unique move. I mean, the underground kind of mitigates the s situation. You just go underground, um, go dig up some items, and then and then um, be happy with it. Pant, pant. Why am I running like this anyway? The new world, the new new universe that our boss was talking about. It's making me giddy thinking about it when we use this thing. Uh oh. You were base dropping, I was only talking to myself. You're persistent too, I'm pooped up from all the running, but I'm not going to battle you. Oh, you're... Uh, no. Wow, that's not far, but you're almost close to the lake. <clears throat> Why not just... <clears throat> <clears throat> Shoot, that sword though, it's gonna catch me. Why didn't you go to the lake? Just use your last bit of energy. Oh no, you're still on my tail. The lake's within sight. You leave me no choice. My Pokemon will KO you. 
You could have battled me right from the start. If you had a flying type Pokemon, you wouldn't need to run like this. Oh, you have a Krogog? Oh, level 31. Snap. I thought I can handle anything. Anyways, um, you're gonna bubble beam this thing. And you don't have dry skin. You got the other one. Oh, you confused me. Let's see. Can we pack it? Don't. Oh. Taking too much of a risk there. And my accuracy fell. It's giving me a harder time to um, attack Krogunk here. But we landed. Anyways, Krogunk's down. Oh, forgot to take out the EXP share from uh, Jolteon. If I didn't run, I could have battled harder. You, regardless, you would have lost, even if you battled with me with your Krogunk at the beginning. I can't battle anymore. I'm running on fumes. I have to give this to the commander. I wish I got to use it at the lake. Well, you got the remote control, so you would have pressed it by now. Anyways. And there is... Oh, Cynthia. Oh, hello. Long time no see. How's your Pokedex filling up? Can not research a folklore about the lake, but, well, it doesn't appear as if the lake's open to the public yet. There's Team Galactic inside. Can't you just barge in? Oh, and we're talking about folklore. All those legendary trios, and then it creates one of the trios, and if three of the other trios come in, it's like, it's like multiples of three with the exponent. But that's why I have something to talk to you. Oh. Stop interrupting me, Barry. Hey, Vince, where's that Galactic Goon run off to? Huh? Is this your older sister? Of course not. Oh, okay. The explosion of the Great March? It wasn't anything serious. Miss Ray told me to tell you that. But that Team Galactic, wow, are they out of control or what? Next time I see them, I'll teach them a lesson they won't forget. See you around. Alright, looks like the champion didn't care about the Team Galactic. He's your friend. He's more impatient than he is energetic, isn't he? So, getting back to where I started saying earlier, have you seen the group Psyduck? I am um, not yet. I kind of missed it. <laughs> you haven't seen them? Oh, it's the cafe. Yeah, I kind of remember it. <laughs> and we got a key item called Secret Potion. I think it's that same potion, like the one in Johto, and and you use it on the Ampharos. Yeah, good times. The Secret Potion... It's like it's stuck on our key item forever, but the only use is to, um... The only use is to, um... Get rid of the path that's blocking your way. The Pokemon of the lake won't come out if it senses people. We're lying in ambush. Oh, so you're a fraud, Protographer. Fraud. One of your Protographers are a complete fraud, trying to ambush, um, the legendary Pokemon. You should be fired from the from Job Life TV. Just saying, an ethical scam. This company should be taken down in fumes. <laughs> Anyways, um, I guess, I guess I can stop by to that Psyduck um, area and then just call it off an episode. So yeah, just give me a few seconds to reach there. And we're super spinning in the rain, actually. Maybe before I uh, proceed to the Psyduck thing, maybe I'm gonna do some off-screen training because my team's kinda below par. Maybe like, um, grinding it to level 36 or maybe like into my, um, water starter, water starter evolves. Okay, so yeah, that's when I'm gonna end it here. Um, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time.